When we watched that sailing just a couple of years ago, we just had a picture from a helicopter. You saw some boats moving a little and you didn't know who's where, who's winning, who's losing. We didn't have any analytics, nothing. And since about for five years now, everything has changed. This is due to SAP and the analytics that we have here. How do they manage to bring sailing from the water to land so that the audience understands sailing? Yeah, all boats uh, racing outside and all marks they have to pass, uh, they uh, got tracked. Um, so we know at any time with uh, one signal per second, uh, we know where they are. And from second to second, we know about the speed and we know about the direction. And so that's, that's the secret, how we follow the racing. And as you said, in the early days, when we were lucky, we had helicopters. But nowadays, uh, we, we have sometimes have had peer cameras from land where you couldn't see anything. Nothing, nothing, no, nothing at all. So, so now, let me just interrupt for a second. Yeah. So now they have these little trackers. They're about this big, smaller than a pack of cigarettes, yeah. which they carry with them. They have a GPS signal and, and they're all being kind of compared together. And then you see who's leading. Yeah, compared to each other and uh, we can go into the performance data at any time in, uh, in any sequence of the racing. We have the leaderboards at any time for the, for the race running, for the series running and for the whole season running. So this is really an amazing uh, add-on we got uh, with the support from SAP. What does this mean for the sailors? Because now they can see how they performed later on and they can really analyze their own performance, right? Yeah, um, before we had this uh, amazing tool, um, we would just talking about what we felt, what was happening out there on the water. And nowadays, uh, there is no, no doubt anymore about what really happened uh, at any time during racing, which is really, uh, let's go into the uh, discussion between a coach and a sailor. Now they do not talk about opinions, they talk about facts. Uh, and so uh, the same for the commentary for racing. They are talking about facts and not believing something is going on. So this is really a new uh, generation of uh, talking about sailing. I know you as a product manager of the Champions League, you're developing the whole product again and again. What's something that we can wait for? What's like the future, what you're dreaming of? Is there any feature missing that you're dreaming of that could be there next year in two years? Uh, yeah, we are developing the system uh, year by year. The onboards are getting better and better. Um, the technique uh, is getting better and better. Uh, the transmission of data is getting better and better. Uh, so whenever these uh, items and options get better, we are improving uh, week by week, month by month. Uh, what will we see in the future? Um, yeah, with the analytics, we, we, uh, we will have more and more options to go into details and tell about the story. And uh, maybe we go into uh, also into the emo emotions with uh, voice um, transmission. Maybe live interviews even during the races? Yeah, right. Live interviews with you uh, assisting us. Sure. That will be exciting. I can't wait for that. Thank you very much. Jockey Helmich, product manager of the, of the Champions League.